Lineup is an interactive technique to create, visualize, and explore multi-attribute rankings. This is the main Lineup interface. Let's assume we are a prospective student looking for a university. We've loaded the QS World University Ranking dataset from 2012. Initially, Lineup is configured as a table-based bar chart with columns for each attribute. Lineup supports different column types. Rank columns that show the rank of items, label and categorical columns for contextual information, and score attribute columns. The header of the score attributes show their distribution. Columns can be moved, resized, removed, and restored. The row layout can be switched between a uniform layout and a fisheye layout. Items can be searched and filtered. We now limit the ranking to universities from the United States. With one click, we have created a simple ranking based on a single attribute. Next, we want to combine multiple attributes to reproduce the ranking methodology used in the QS World University Ranking. We first create an empty combined column and use drag and drop to add attributes. We can sort the column by double-clicking its header. To reproduce the exact weights used for the published ranking, we enter them directly. The width of the column reflects the weight. Weights can be adjusted interactively. As a future student, we might want to put more emphasis on the faculty-student ratio. The weight changes are immediately applied and the ranking is updated. Lineup uses animation and colors to indicate rank changes. Animations are useful to track small changes, but bigger changes are difficult to follow. To better keep track of big changes, we use the snapshot feature. The slope graph separator acts as a barrier and splits the table into two independent rankings. If we now remove the citations attribute from the combined score, the changing slope angles indicate that New York University rises from the 18th position to the 11th. To see detailed information about the rank changes, we can show rank deltas. In Lineup, users can not only change the weight of attributes, but also their values. For example, we can change the international student ratio of NYU and immediately see the effects. This causes NYU to rise to the 10th place. Let's say we are interested in studying a science subject. We additionally include faculty-specific attributes. As we don't know whether we want to focus on natural sciences or engineering, we want to look for universities that are strong in at least one of these two areas, but not necessarily in both. Such questions can be realized using the parallel combination method. We just drag the engineering attribute onto the natural sciences attribute. We are also not interested in arts and humanities at all. We use the mapping editor built into Lineup to change how the attribute values are converted to scores. We set the filter to remove all universities with a strong arts faculty. We could even invert the mapping so that lower attribute values give us better scores. We can see that New York University drops back to the 14th place and that MIT is the overall winner. This was a short introduction of Lineup, an interactive technique designed to create, visualize and explore multi-attribute rankings. Thank you for watching our video.